Uh, so, does uh, ginkgo biloba thin blood, and is that good? Well, the answer is yes. Ginkgo biloba does thin blood, but it can, can be both good and bad. Blood itself carries all types of great stuff to organs that need it, like vitamins, nutrients, stuff like that. Um, more blood flow is basically means that it makes stronger organs. It can also be very good for the heart, uh, which, let's all be honest, is pretty much overworked. I like to think of it like blowing a, a piece of paper out of a straw. The more crammed out the paper is, the harder it is to, to move that uh, out of the straw and shoot it out. Now another thing it does is it prevents the number one cause of death in the United States. Can you guess what that is? Yep, it's heart disease. Thinner blood means that it's less likely that a clot will appear and blood will be stopped from reaching the heart. Of course, it helps with improving memory, preventing Alzheimer's, stuff like that too. So there's a lot of benefits to it. Now, disadvantages of thin blood um, is that it takes longer for the human body to stop a cut from bleeding out. Losing blood is not very good at all. Uh, plus, it reduces someone's immune system. Now, in conclusion, uh, now considering how heart disease is the biggest killer out there, I really think there's more advantages to having thin blood than if it's thick. Uh, but what do you think? Um, just go ahead and leave a comment below uh, if you can. Also, one of the best ways uh, to get ginkgo biloba is through a supplement. Now, you should actually be somewhat careful when choosing supplements and buying them because, well, they're kind of loosely regulated. The fact is, companies don't really have to uh, mention side effects, and it's easy for them to make a crappy product. I recommend actually viewing a, a free ebook guide that I wrote that can actually walk someone through the process of how to avoid overpriced or a crappy, crummy supplement products. Um, and to go and view this guide, just go ahead and click on the link uh, right below this video, and uh, I hope you enjoy it.